we have a special announcement for you all. And his name is Paddington Bear, but we call him Bear Bear. <laughs> He's our baby. He's our He's actually settling in pretty well. The first night, I had him with me in a basket because you wouldn't like Puppy, yeah, yeah. puppies can wet the bed. That wouldn't be good. So I had him right next to me near my pillow. And it's like, okay, I've got him to sleep. Let's just hope he doesn't whine. Two seconds later. Whine! <laughs> it's, like, it's, it's not easy, but he was okay. He was worth it. Melina slept well that night. No, I did not. But it was worth it. Look at him. Isn't he beautiful? Gigi's like, take him back. Gigi at the moment's like, when is this thing leaving? <laughs> yeah, but he's beautiful. Well, Gigi, he's used to stay. To Ben Spaniels, they Why? don't want to play fetch. Like, 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 Gigi, so like, ball, fetch it, Gigi. It's like, they're so intelligent, they're just like, you go get it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it, it just go get the ball. A bear bear, he likes toys. And that's yeah. great. I'm so happy that he actually does like toys. They don't uh, really need a lot of exercise, but they do appreciate like their playtime and walking and all sorts of things. Like Gigi loves it. When we, we have to like spell it out so that Gigi doesn't go like in a dopamine rush. They are pretty rare and hard to find, but um, you can get yours, you would have to get yours from a breeder. Mummy had one before we got married, Sandy. Yeah. And then our first dog, our first Tibetan Spaniel, yeah, was, Toss. was Toss. And he was named after a very good artist friend of mine. And one of the coolest things that ever happened with Toss, when he was just four months older than Bear Bear, mm -hmm. he was being really obnoxious, which he did a lot. Mm -hmm. And he, I said to him, Toss, get your pillow, go to Danelle's office and lay down. It's a few minutes later, Literally going past my office door was this puppy dragging his pillow backwards to Danelle's office and, and he lay down. And then Bernie, we had Bernie and Toss at the same time. Yeah. We got one of these things because Bernie would hold this between his paws and literally pull the ripcord with his teeth so Toss could play with it. Mm. Do you want another Toss story? Yes. Yeah. I used to play the start of Benny and the Jets. Yeah. Well, play the whole thing actually. Yeah. And as soon as the first chord was played, Toss would go, Woo! Like the <laughs> Benny. Benny! Benny! And he'd keep going. And he did the same with Michael Jackson's Earth song. Oh, that's so cute! And he did it from a. Oh, look at this puppy. Oh, you're so gorgeous. Are you waving to all the fans? Yeah. He's so brand new. We only have him for two days already. He's only two days with us and two months old. Tibetans are, guess what? They're an aristocratic dog because they were the dogs of Northern Asian, no, yes, but also Northern Asian um, royalty. And they were also um, with the Tibetan monks. They're famous for the Tibetan monks because they're extraordinary watchdogs. But more interestingly, oh. <laughs> he's telling us all about it. They I really, they before. warned the big dogs yeah. when bad stuff was happening. Or like when strangers were coming. Yeah, and we've had Tibetans for now 24 years, and, and they let us know whenever there's something not quite right. Mm -hmm. They like to watch over their house from on high. Yeah, as you've seen, um, mm -hmm. Gigi. So interestingly, you probably don't remember when we brought Gigi home as a puppy, or well, you perhaps you do. A little bit. But Bear Bear, well, you're never going to forget Bear Bear. Yeah. It's better to give love rewards instead of like uh, punishments to train them since they respond badly to like, punishments. Good boy. Yes, right, good. Bear Bear. Like, especially if they go outside and they do their business, you got to treat it like it's the best thing in the world because like, otherwise, it, like. Sorry. You got to treat. You got to treat. Like that poo was the greatest thing <laughs> that could ever happen in the world. That way they will want to go outside to do their business instead of indoors. Yes. Like on your precious oh carpet. Oh my goodness, almighty one, you have done well. You've done well like, to deliver oh my this good boy. glorious business you oh, dropped on when, the when, when Bear Bear did his first. <laughs> <laughs> you yeah, made sure to make him know that it's good. I gotta say this with a straight face. When Bear Bear did his first. <laughs> 
when Bear Bear did his first little business in the yard, <laughs> Sienna treated it like it was the most loveliest. It was thing like that heaven could ever sent. It was like a lump of gold. <laughs> Except that had been turned brown. Yeah. A bronze, let's it's say. It's bronze. Yeah. <laughs> they usually grow up to be about 10 inches high and between 9 to 15 pounds. <laughs> So. Oh, so one thing that's really cool is they're not overeaters, and some hide uh, precious leftovers in mysterious places. Yeah. Another thing that's really cool about these dogs is they can learn to understand a lot of words. As, oh, they're affectionate and they're affectionate and loving. They're not really dogs that like to be cuddled all the time, but they do really like to be near people. Yeah. As we've discussed, they are pretty intelligent. So they're smart little buddies. Uh, they are pretty loyal. Oh, very curious. Our little bear bear, he's only been here for two days and he's already starting to figure out there's something behind our doors. So whenever he can't get into one, he starts to whine a little. Or can't get out. They are independent thinkers. So one thing to be aware of is they're not always keen to uh, obey or quick. They're, they're not always quick to obey you. But, mm. oh. So they have to wear, so they have to have a fence. And you can only walk uh, on a leash that they will wander off due to their curiousness. So one thing they need is a daily brush and that can easily become their daily cuddle. Um, because yeah. they're so oh, tiny when they so little. Oh, yes. It's like, I don't like this. I don't like the publicity. It's scary. Look like they're scary. He's scary him. <laughs> it's why He's that good. They will engage in recreational barking when they get, you know, um, mad at, or bored. Um, Gigi barks at other dogs, cuz. <laughs> um, and she's barking at us and Bear Bear right now, cause she's like, What is this? Why did you have this into our home? Was I not good enough? So at the moment, we're watching videos on how to get uh, the Them older to dog like to like a puppy. And we'll let you know how that goes. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed this adventure of meeting our little, little baby brother. And like and subscribe. You'll get to see lots more, more of him, him if you do. Yeah.